You saw the television news pictures of last Saturday's anti-war protest. No one disputes that it was sizable and that, for the most part, it was peaceful. The United States of America will not permit the world's most dangerous regimes to threaten us with the world's most destructive weapons. Lorna Tai Chasta, freelance photographer and mother of two, is determined to fight against a war with Saddam Hussein. What if your wife or your mother told you that she was headed to Iraq for two weeks? Well, three New York moms who call themselves the Hudson Valley Peace Brigade are headed there tomorrow for a 10-day mission of what they're describing as peace. I'm going there to see the people. I'm going there because these people aren't going to be um, liberated. They're going to be annihilated. This is left-wing propaganda. <laughs> when you start dividing it into left and right, that's not the issue here. But you are a leftist. Whose mom goes over there and why? I mean, besides stuff you see on TV, it's not really something typical of people you know. The pressure of my kids, that, that, is, um, that is killer. You know, I know my daughter does not want me to go to Iraq. Two million people have marched against this war. You can protest here all you want because that's free speech protected under the First Amendment. That's fine. No, I'm an American. But to carry your protest to enemy territory when we are on the eve of war seems to me villainous and bordering on treason. If we're going to go in and kill people, then we better damn well be willing to look into the eyes of the people who we're going to kill. This is the only road all the way across the desert and we're going to end up in Baghdad. As a photographer I have to really be, I get very close to people even if I don't have a, even a, more than a split second to take their shot. I mean I live with them after that and they develop within me and I carry them around. I shot 45 rolls. I have to capture an essence of someone. I just don't like to take a picture of someone. I, I don't know what is the exchange that happens, but to get them to just pop open for a minute so that I can see some real image from inside. Because otherwise, why bother taking a picture of somebody? because the photo's really for them.